everybody, Wiggler here. Welcome back to Undertale. How are you today? I hope you're fantastic. So, let's go, shall we? What happened? We killed Paprius. Well, we didn't kill him. We befriended Paprius on the first try. And apparently, that was very hard to do, apparently. He came back with a mistake with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you somewhere really special. I guess I'd like to spend a lot of time. So, a date with Paprius? What's this going to happen now? Or is that just that? Is it round as block, is it? My house, yeah, you fucking idiot, isn't he? So he's a monkey. What the hell is in that room up there? It's like Inferno on it, what's going on? Oh, Paprius, what this date then? Welcome to Senate, your scenic house, my house. Yes, enjoy and take your time. That's my room. If you're finished looking around, you can go in and do whatever people do when they date. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Let's just have a look around. Let's have a little bone. Classic image! It always reminds me of what's important in life. Oh, a good bone. <laughs> what the hell's in here? The door is locked. Well, how about that? This. The joke book. Take a look inside. Hell yeah! Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. Look inside. Inside the quantum physics book it was another joke book. Look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Yeah, exactly right. I mean, come on. The kitchen. Impressed. I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look, see. There's a cat in here. What? Catch that meddling canine. Curses. <laughs> Sans! Stop plaguing my life with innocent music. <laughs> Fucking brilliant. These two are our characters. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please! Pursue my culinary art show. Half the fridge is full with containers all labelled spaghetti. And the half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Isn't it? What's the trash can? You're free to visit at any time. Yeah, I guess so. My brother always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tried baking something. It was like... A cookie. A quiche, I know. But filled with a... That sundry non-egg substance. How absurd. Well, that was interesting. What's this? That's my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. Look, it's covered in sprinkles. Oh, how about that? Oh, it's my favourite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me. The dirty sock with a si series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down, move it. Okay. <laughs> you moved it two inches, move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's like, it's like living on a comedy show, isn't it, really? Touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20 gold. Oh, baby. Let's get the room and do what date stuff do. That's my room. You can finish looking around. We can go and do whatever people do their day on. Yeah, let's go inside. Let's go inside. Let's what happens. Just bones. Hey. Those are all the, all the attacks I've used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Well, it kind of was, actually. Even though it basically just happened. Yeah, yeah, off the PC. The internet. I'm quite popular out there. It, I'm just a... In just a dozen ways. I'm a double-digit following count. Oh, following count. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Always, always them sending me, me bad puns in a goofy font. Probably Sands, mate. Probably your brother Sands. 
That book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzles, construction for criti critical minds. Next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with fluffy bunny. Landing always gets me. <laughs> ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How many? How, how do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. Oh, very funny, funny. Very funny. Isn't that flag neato? Undying found it at the bay. Oh, Undying, eh? I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must be descendants from skeletons. <laughs> well, we hear, we hear a skeletal structure and all that stuff, but I don't think that's right. What's in here? There are no skeletons in the closet, except me sometimes. In the closet. Go on then, what is it? Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh, that's a bit of a letdown. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I like to drive down a long highway, wind in my hair, sun on my skin, of course. That's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Yes, we get a date! Yes, I have a date with Paprius! Okay, dating started. Dating start. Here we are on our day. I've actually never done this before, but don't worry, you can spell prepared without several letters from my name. That's very true, actually, yeah. I snagged an official date and rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. Tuesday. Wowie! I feel so informed. What the fuck is this all about? I think we're ready for step two. Step two ask them on a date. Um, human. I, the great Paprius, will go on a date with you. Hell yeah. R really? Wowie! Look at his face! It's adorable! I guess that means it's okay. This is time for part three. Step three. Put on those clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that. Early today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes! Oh my god, he's like... Ah! <laughs> no! You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. <laughs> no! Your dating power is at maximum. <laughs> Don't think you be you bested me yet. I oh, you're a piece. I've never been beaten at dating and never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Cool dude, baby. The cool dude. What do you think of my style? I love it, baby. No. A genuine compliment. Date power. Increase. However. You don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is in, in, is in, in valid. Well, that's the date won't escalate any further, unless you find my, my secret. But that won't happen. Move and respect for Z. Right. The shirt didn't originally say cool dude, but I improved it. Yeah. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. My hat? My hat? My hat! <laughs> well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it! Was it lasagna or something? Or spaghetti? Do you know what this is? Of course. Spaghetti! Yeah, I told you! Fucking spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Yep, right, uh huh. But oh, so wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an. An artisan's work! Silicon spaghetti? 
finally, finally, finally A's in an, an oaken casket, then cooked by me, Master Sephiroth, human, it's time to end this. There's no way you can go any further. Eat it. Take a small bite. Your face relaxedly scrumbles up. Mm. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love cooking and be an extension to me. Oh, maybe even more than I do. Date power! Date power! No! All the date power is going through his mind! <laughs> so much date power! Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Paprius. I, um, boy, it's hot in here. Or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean... I mean, I'm t I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion. He's breaking up with me already! He's breaking up with me already! How dare he break up with me? But alas, I, the Ripper Prius, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead of by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into the intense love for me. A dark passion of, of dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? A lot of talk in this episode. Christ. No. Wait. That's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Demon. I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are the very great. You are very great. It would be tragic to lose such a friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you sell for second best. <laughs> yeah. Well, that was interesting. Uh, David for Prius, that was actually quite fun. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. And call me anytime. Well, gotta go. Nee hee hee. Oh, burn. We're now little pen pals, are we? Well, that was. That was kind of interesting. Can I speak, speak, speak to Sands now? No, I can't speak to Sands yet. Oh, I don't want to go in there. Well then. <laughs> Let's go save it, shall we? Bloody hell, I said. Done so much talking, my throat is dry, I need to get a drink. Oh, Lord. There we go, the date with Papriest. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. That was amazing, I really enjoyed that. That was awesome. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. And as always, I will see you in the next episode of Undertale. So until then, my friends, goodbye.